We're just trying, like, friends, so it shouldn't matter if I get the name wrong. Anyway, he was actually doing a documentary about the guy, the herbalist, that found a cure for all these diseases, and he was then killed just before the documentary came out. And I'm not a conspiracist, conspiracy theory person, I don't go on about that, I don't talk about it much, but I am someone stays. <laughs> Can I say it? Okay, I'm gonna say it. I'm someone that stays woke. <laughs> I can't believe I just said that. So cringe. But I do. Like, I'm one of those people that, that I'm going to... I'm gonna take these things on and listen to them and not assume that they're fake or I'm not gonna think they're too far-fetched because stuff like this happens. Anyway, he was killed right before his documentary came out about the herbalist that killed that cured cancer and AIDS and other diseases. I mean, to me, that just screams the government killed him. They killed the herbalist and they killed Nipsey. Um, uh, the reason why Overpopulated the world comes becomes. Hold on, actually. We're gonna look into this some more because I've had a drink and why not? Also, I just did a custom ASMR, it was really, really cool. So, if you want a custom one, you can email me. I think one of those, I'm in one of those moods, but I just want to chill and talk to you guys, so here I am. Okay, so, let me see, okay. So I've just typed in, uh, Nipsey Hussle Cancer. So, the guy that was doing the documentary, and the guy that, that Nipsey was doing the documentary on, was called Dr. Sebi. It just makes me so sad, but anyway. Okay, so this here it says five facts you need to know. Five facts that you need to know. Okay. So it says right here, Dr. 
Dr. Sebi believed he found the cure for AIDS, cancer, diabetes and blindness. He built a cult-like a cult following for all his natural remedies, formula and toxins and supplements. He believed that the food that was alkaline for the body. He believed that food was alkaline for the body and that dead food and that dead foods killed the body's ability to heal itself. Therefore, he recommended a strict vegan diet and cut up all the foods he considered to be toxic. Alcohol. Sugar. Sorry, Bob. These foods were placed with fresh fruit, fruit, vegetables, healthy grains and nut butter. I believe the body would earn back its natural healing powers. Mm. This is good. <sighs> I know. I'm so sorry. It looks like I'm trolling. Holiday where I, where I ate Nutella crepes every day. So, trying to wean myself off and get back into shape is very hard. Okay, so he believed that helps cure all these diseases and things like that. Okay, some of you are going to believe that, some of you aren't. Um, in the case of the vegan thing, I'm not sure what I believe personally. Okay, there has been a conspiracy for years that the government had killed Dr. Sebi. At 28, well, at 82 years of old, Dr. Sebi died in Hundra. At 28 years of old, 28, 28 years of age, 82 years of age is when Dr. Sebi died. A few months early before his death, Sebi had been arrested for money laundering. <laughs> what? What? At the time, he was boarding a plane with his business partner, Pablo. He had £37,000 in cash, which is a hell of a lot of money, to have in cash in his suitcase. After being released a few days later, Sebi was once again arrested by the police for money laundering again and remained in prison until he died on the way to hospital. <sighs> that shit's fishy. That's really fishy. When people asked, when asked why people killed the holistic doctor, Nipsey Hussle said, why do they kill all holistic doctors? They're messing up the medical industry. I mean, he's right there. But... It's all a bit of a mess, isn't it? Dr. Sebi had numerous famous patients, included Michael Jackson, Left Eye, John Travolta, Eddie Murphy. Dr. Hebby, Dr. Sebi was paid handsomely for his services. It makes sense why he'd so much cash in him, which is true. I've got Nutella on my face. Nipsey Hussle appeared to have been in the early stage of his of his documentary. Um, someone tweeted this. Now I know. I, now I know. I'm sorry, guys. This is just a casual conversation. I'm not a conspiracy person. I'm just having a chat with you guys as friends about the situation. Okay, so the theory surrounding Dr. Sebi's of... Okay, now I don't know much about Nipsey Hussle's situation, just like me, I'm just learning as you guys are. But it's not a shocker to me that he got gone down after he announces that he'll be doing a documentary on Dr. Sebi's death. Shake my head. Now... Of a headache from the wine. 
anyway i completely agree with this i do believe he was killed because he wanted to bring out the documentary such a powerful voice um within the young generation bringing out a documentary on a herbalist who can cure all these diseases they're gonna get so many people looking into into this so many people realizing that it's not just medi medication that can cure things there's things that out there herbs natural remedies that can actually cure things they don't want people looking into that kind of stuff okay whether you believe it or not we all know who the corrupt people are in this world the theory surrounding dr sebi's arrest and the eventful death stem from the fact that if his cure was correct he would he would have been bankrupt he would have bankrupt the medical community according to those who believed in theory as they say there's no money in a cure there's money in sickness and if the ants and if the answer slash cure is merely living a strictly healthy lifestyle that also kills the entire diet pill and exercise community okay let's bring it back there's many people that want to live a healthy lifestyle go to the gym get big get a big booty but there is vegans that can do this however we all know that it's easier to get all that by just eating its protein, eating meat, eating these supplement, supplements. It may not be the healthy option, but it's what I do. Anyway, how did we get onto this topic? What? We, we, we had a civilized ASMR conversation, a little chat, a little Nutella. And we've got into some serious stuff. Anyway, I'm tired and I've got to do another guest custom ASMR enjoyed this chat if you enjoy these chatty videos with me just talking loads of cod swallop then be sure to let me know and we'll do some more in the future okay okay i'm gonna do a thumbnail did you want to watch the process of a thumbnail